हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू ऑर्किड सी लर्निंग टूडे लेट अस सी द एक्सरसाइजेस ऑफ द लेसन एयर एंड वॉटर फ्रॉम क्लास साइंस लेट्स बिगिन क्वेश्चन नंबर वन चूज द करेक्ट ऑप्शन फर्स्ट द थिक लेयर ऑफ एयर दैट सराउंड द अर्थ ऑप्शन आर ऑप्शन ए ऑक्सीजन बी एटमोस्फेयर C wind and D nitrogen Think about your answer And the answer is B atmosphere Next the layers of the atmosphere from bottom to top are Look at the options first stratosphere mesosphere thermosphere troposphere and exosphere b mesosphere thermosphere stratosphere troposphere and exosphere c thermosphere stratosphere troposphere exosphere and mesosphere and d troposphere stratosphere mesosphere thermosphere and exosphere Now think about your answer. You need to arrange the layers of atmosphere from bottom to top. And the answer is D. That is troposphere, stratosphere, mesosphere, thermosphere and exosphere. Next, which of the following is insoluble in water? A sand, B sugar, C common salt and D milk which is insoluble in water it is A sand rest all are soluble next the rate of sedimentation can be improved by option A heating B loading C cooling and d boiling which process is used to improve the rate of sedimentation you can write your answers in the comment section for the better practice and the answer is b loading next question insoluble impurities can be removed by A distillation B filtration C boiling and D chlorination And the answer is A distillation Now next question state whether the following statements are true or false First Argon is a colorless gas and is used in making light bulbs. You can write in the comment section T for true or F for false in shortcut. It is true. Second, neon protects us from the harmful ultraviolet rays of the sun. False. third drinking through a straw would not be possible without air it is possible or not possible drinking through a straw if there is air present if there is air not present it is true we need air okay next common salt can be removed from water by the process of filtration false fifth one is distilled water is the purest form of water true next write two examples of each of the following for each statement you need to give two examples first insoluble impurities in water what are the insoluble impurities are there in water you can give any two examples it's not mandatory whatever i am sharing here is 
ओनली करेक्ट फ्रॉम मेनी एग्जाम्पल्स यू नीड टू गिव टू एग्जाम्पल्स करेक्ट इन द सेंस आई एम गिविंग करेक्ट ओनली बट देन यू कैन चूज योर ओन एग्जाम्पल्स ऑल्सो ओके सो द फर्स्ट इज इन सोल्यूबल इम्प्योरिटीज इन वॉटर एंड द आंसर इज सैंड टी लीव्स नेक्स्ट सोल्यूबल इम्प्योरिटीज इन वॉटर common salt and sugar next methods for removing insoluble impurities filtration and sedimentation methods for removing soluble impurities evaporation and distillation and the last is methods for purifying drinking water boiling and chlorination next write one word for the following for each question you need to write one word answer here first one substances that make water unfit for use it is germs there are many substances that can make water unfit for use but as this is one word answer you need to give only one word so it is germs next the method in which the insoluble impurities are removed with the help of filter paper in which method we use filter paper to remove insoluble impurities filtration next the process by which rate of sedimentation can be improved loading fourth one the simplest way to purify drinking water boiling the process of purifying water by adding chlorine tablets chlorination next match the followings look at the options in column a in column a we have filtration chlorination common salt insoluble impurities and alum now let's see column b soluble impurity sedimentation chlorine tablet loading and filter paper and the answer is filtration filter paper chlorination chlorine tablet common salt soluble impurity insoluble impurities sedimentation and alum loading fill in the blanks first air is a mixture of dash you have two options here you need to choose the correct options from the two options and the two options for the first statements are smells gases air is a mixture of dash smells or gases it is gases the dash layer protects us from the harmful ultraviolet rays ozone or nitrogen which layer it is ozone next fire cannot burn without dash nitrogen or oxygen which is important for the fire to burn it is nitrogen we can drink through a straw because of dash air pressure or water pressure it is air pressure and the next is questions and answers first question is what is the atmosphere the thick layer of air that surrounds the earth it's called atmosphere question number 2 name the various layers of atmosphere the five layers of atmosphere are 
ट्रोपोस्पेर स्ट्रैटोस्पेर मेसोस्पेर थर्मोस्पेर एंड एक्सोस्पेर नेक्स्ट हाउ डज द एटमोस्पेर प्रोटेक्ट सर्स फ्रॉम मिटेरॉइड हिट्स and the answer is the meteoroids are small rocks moving about in space meteoroids may cause harm if they hit the surface of the earth most of these meteoroids burn up in the atmosphere before they can reach the surface of the earth in this way they protect us from hits what is air pressure fourth question what is air pressure the weight of the air pushes down on everything around us in all directions we call this air pressure name any three impurities that make water unfit for use and the answer is Impurities such as sand, germs, dirt or mud can make water unfit for use. What are the two kinds of impurities in water? Give examples. And the answer is The two kinds of impurities are as following. First is soluble impurities. that can dissolve in water i'm sorry for the spelling mistake here it is not immunities it is soluble impurities that can dissolve in water example common salt and second is insoluble impurities that do not dissolve in water example is sand and mud i repeat this is soluble impurities Next seventh question what is loading And the answer is the rate of sedimentation can be improved by adding special chemical such as alum this process is called loading Differentiate between boiling and distillation Boiling is a process of converting liquid to its vapor. Distillation is a process of purification or separation from others by converting the liquid in vapor and condensing the vapor into a pure liquid in another vessel. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching please like and subscribe my channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon to stay updated your comments and suggestions are valuable to us